Welcome to Sidra's lifestyle. Daisy's beautiful kittens have turned for weeks. Therefore I have decided to introduce to litter tray to Mele, the bear, Waskella and Tyson. Follow these steps for how to litter train a kitten. Show them the boxes as soon as they arrive by setting the cat in them and letting them sniff and examine them. Be sure not to move the boxes once you've shown them to your cat, to avoid confusion. Set your cat in one of the boxes immediately following meals and after waking up from naps. If you notice them behaving like they need to go, on, which might look this like slipping or crouching time. in a particular area, pick them up and put them in the litter box. Reward them whenever you notice they are using it. Praise them and give them a treat or a toy. Don't punish or scold for accidents. Doing so will only lead to stress and anxiety, which may exacerbate the problem and make training more difficult. Cats do not associate punishment with the incident in question, so it doesn't help train them not to do it in the future. Cleaning and Maintenance It's important to Manic. take proper care of the litter box. Not only will this help eliminate the dreaded cat smell from your home, but it will also make using the box a more pleasant experience for your cat. Scoop the box daily to remove your kitten's deposits. Replace soiled litter as needed, typically when the litter stops Hi, controlling Dana. odor. Clean and disinfect the box when you change out the litter. Use mild soap and water, or a solution of water and white vinegar. Don't use bleach, commercial disinfectants or other harsh chemicals, which could be harmful to your cat. Use an enzyme cleaner to clean areas outside Tyson, the box where baby. your kitten has had accidents. You need to explore this the type trip. of cleaner will eliminate the smell which, if left untreated, might encourage them to keep going in that spot. Daisy, they need to train to use the little tray. Look at naughty Melek. Daisy, are you showing them how to jump out? 